Gemini, thank you for tuning in to Perfectly Imperfect Tarot. This is Green Eyes, here to give you your reading, love. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, Martians, Astronauts, pick a node, it doesn't matter to me. I love you all. Cross Watchers, I am a snitch. I'm telling you now. Please don't curse me in the comments, okay? Love you too. Uh, Gemini, this is a judgment-free zone, but you will hear the truth. There's no gender here. It's all energy. But you're going to hear me use the terms he, she, her, him, they, them, it, heifer. Take it how it resonates, my love. Okay? Remember, roles can always be reversed. A couple of things here. Uh, one is Gemini... Some, some of you are really, how can I say this? I'm picking up anger. I'm picking up confusion. And I don't want to say fear. Um, it's not really fear. It, I don't know. It's definitely uncomfortable. I think that you yourself look in the mirror and you see power and strength and beauty and I love that. I love the confidence. Um, I think you know what you bring to the table and more. You know what I'm saying? I think that um, you're unfortunately connected to an energy that feels that you're kind of two different worlds. I don't know. Uh, men are from Mars, women are from Venus kind of vibe. You know what I mean? Um, it, That's how this feels, okay? Um, I think that for a lot of you, you just feel cheated. I ain't gonna lie. You just feel cheated, okay? Um, there's a lot of counseling here. Therapy, maybe. You just started therapy. Talking about old times and old life, uh, childhood things. Taken back. Orphans is at the bottom of the deck. Um, I think that really you're digging deep and discussing or in your prayers or with others, I'm going to say it like that, of the root of the issue, whatever your issue is, whatever you feel is causing you to keep running into the same problems in your life or to be where you are in your life right now, okay? Did I cut this? I feel like I did, but I'm not sure. Center energy please for Gemini. We're gonna put some tar tarot down with Nefertiri, Empress, Knave of Swords, the World, and Two of Swords. Ow. Again, uh, Two of Swords, Confusion, um, Air Energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, on an ending with the completion here with the world and you know uh world energy um so maybe you might be actually stalking uh this person that you see who is could be your everything or you could be their everything remember roles can always be reversed possibly a libra or a taurus okay crowning energy please for gemini it's the same energy the lovers and the five of wands crowning it's a fight gemini this is you fighting trying to figure out who what where why and how or how to get over this under it around it um you are fighting either against this connection or to get this connection but i don't think this emperor sees you um, as a possibility or prospect. We we talked about this before. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what's undermining Gemini? You know what? That's what I want to add. What's undermining Gemini? Let's do that first. Gemini, I'm going to put a spread down and we could, then we're going to put one on that Empress. Because this has been going on long enough. We need to know the truth. What's undermining Gemini's energy right now, please? Thank you. Six of Wands, victory and success. The Knave of Wands, 
uh, creativity, passion, and a new beginning. Seven of Swords, not realizing the truth, not having the whole story, and Ten of Cups, wish fulfillment. Everything that you want, you can't have, damn it. I don't know why. But you see this, you see possibilities uh, as being endless. And it seems like those things, that victory and possibility and wish fulfillment and everything that you see with this Empress is just is working against you. It's slowing you down because the Empress is not, they've already completed their cycle with you in their mind. And the Empress come out on top. The Empress is the embodiment of all four queens, you know? And again, remember roles can be reversed, Gemini. So, but... <sighs> This is how this feels to me. Okay. Where is this coming from? Can I have one on the pass for Gemini? Hierophant. This could be a life partner. This could be um, Taurus energy here. Uh, hierarchy energy here. Knowledge energy. Uh, culture. Upbringing. School. Church. Uncle Earl, Aunt, Aunt Betty, you know, uh, somebody respectful um, that you would receive uh, their information and guidance because it comes from wisdom. Um, but the energy is saying that in the past, there was a time that you basically tapped into this and that's what made you see this empress as an empress. This is male or female, remember. You understand? Uh, future energy. Where's this going for Gemini? Where's this? Five of Swords. Confusion. Foolishness. See, this is what I don't like for the, for Gemini uh, is that I don't want this to turn you bitter into the fact that you need revenge just because somebody is uninterested because you don't understand why. Now, Gemini, I know that was harsh. We talking. Don't nobody have to know, okay? It's just between us. But we talking, all right? So I'm telling you the truth. Eight of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Toilet paper torture. To you, you're doing this to yourself, my love. And God has so much more for you waiting for you to get over this. Once you can get over this, then he can do what he got to do in your life. But you're intertwining your energy into somebody that's trying to move on with theirs. And I, I, I'm going to tell you the truth. You know, I love you. I'm going to tell you the truth. Um, I want you to know about this empress because I don't think you, you, you have the closure. So let's see if we can get her to talk. And then we'll clarify for you. And I know this is not my normal, so guys, forgive me if you're new or if you just want to talk about you. I just want to help, you know, where I can, okay? Help who I can, where I can, because somebody is just really struggling and suffering. And I don't want, I don't want you to do that to yourself because you're beautiful. Center energy, please, for the Empress. How does the Empress feel about Gemini? Can we just talk about that, please? How does the Empress feel about Gemini? How does the Nine of Wands, they don't trust you. They don't trust you. They feel that they have to protect themselves from you. And they feel that whatever you did to them in the past, they cannot move on from. What they can do is entertain and be cordial but they cannot let you into their personal space, okay? Can you please tell me more? Tell me more. Queen of Swords, again, Libra Energy, Nine of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. They honestly feel that what you feel is genuine with this love of the Queen of Cups. Your emotions are true. They might not see you as stable with the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. They might not think that... Um, you have uh, security, foundation. Um, it, it Honestly, it feels like, this feels, it doesn't feel like, like you don't have the money. It's more, it feels like you don't have, maybe uh, they feel like you don't have, um, it feels immature. 
I ain't gonna lie, like you maybe live for the day, you have fun today, but you're not thinking about tomorrow kind of thing. And um, they feel that uh, even, even though now you're speaking your truth, because the Queen of Swords does speak the truth, okay? Um, they feel that that's why they can entertain, to be honest, because you match their inner, you guys have really good conversations, godly. Um, really, 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 they can talk to you, you can talk to them, you know, everything is good on that end. But they don't see you as um, stable. Um, they see you speaking the truth this time. They see you you're uh, being honest about your emotions. They don't see you as stable. And they see that, um, to be honest, that in the time that was... That they went through their own circle uh, cycle in their life, where they are now, to, to be with you would be a step backwards. The Empress, remember, is the embodiment of all four queens. They see you, and they see you as very uh, good, honestly. You know, I mean, you're not pages coming out here. You got a Queen of Swords and a Queen of um, Cups. So they honor uh, who you are and where you are, and you're definitely no slouch in no way, shape, or form. They just don't see security with you for whatever reason. They also don't trust you, okay? They don't trust you at all. All right, and I'm going to leave that there for those that wanted it. Uh, we're going to put it right here. So now you know exactly what the emperor fe uh, empress is feeling. What's under there with the magician? See, they still think you're playing games. Oh, my love. And they're done with that judgment. They're trying to move on, my loves. And you are still going into the... You're confused on why are you leaving? Five of swords, six of swords. Why are you leaving? Why are you doing this? But then once you process this, you'll have an understanding of this uh, tower so that you can reconnect with self and move on. All right. Now, let's finish talking about you. For the Geminis that that wasn't for, I apologize. Thank you for your patience. Um... So, if it's not an empress that you're connected to, and this is not a love situation, I want to say that right now you're in an energy of, I'm the ish, everybody knows it, I'm done with foolishness, um, the only thing that's standing in my way uh, is that I'm not, I haven't really figured out yet where I'm going and what I want to do, I just know that it seems like everything I want is working against me. You know, I ain't going to lie. We talking. We talking. It's like uh, you want this car, but it's a stick. You can't drive a stick. You know what I mean? You want this house. It's in the wrong neighborhood. Okay. You like this person. They just a little too young for you. It's like always something. You know what I'm saying? Let's start with the hair font. What brought all this energy on? It's a lot of energy here. Oh, okay. We just talking. Ten of Swords. Hello. <sighs> done. Over it. I'm over it. I'm done. I'm done. I'm over it. I'm done. You know, it, you, for, well, for all of you, I could say this. No matter what your situation is currently, I'm going to say that yesterday you reached a point or, you know, I'm not, not literally yesterday, but, you know, yesterday you reached a point where you were like, I am over all of this. I just want a brand new start. I just want, I, I can't do this no more. Tell me more. Damn. Six of Wands reverse. Yeah. Um, you're done. You were done. You felt like... Uh, Everybody, nobody was on your team. Nobody was on your team. Everybody, like, they was all in cahoots against you. Give me another one, please. Yeah, five of cups. And it hurt. There's some shoulda, woulda, couldas here. I ain't gonna lie. But see, everybody's against you. Nobody's on your team. But you know how you were raised. You know what you believe in. You know how you came up. You know what you heard. You know what you know, period. So because of those things, you took that energy to push forward. You just can't turn around. You know, the five of cups is looking over cups that spilled, but there are two cups here that are full and ready. All right. But, you know, the energy is saying that you got to turn around. And for some of you where you are now, you are still in this five of cups today, but you're trying to. It's like you turn around, take a sip and then you turn back around and look at the cups that are on the ground. You turn around, take a sip, 
turn around back at the look at the cups on the ground you know what i mean current energy please for gemini current energy current energy please thank you so much page of swords again we got two page of swords here i'm just saying this is like stalker to the 25th power gemini i'm gonna need you to cut it out if this is you i'm gonna need you to cut it is so invasive for to stalk i i, I personally feel like that now like I said, this is a judgment-free zone, so I'm going to read these damn cards, but I got something to say. I don't like it. Shoot. Center energy. Center energy, please, for Gemini. Moon. Queen of Wands. Piscean energy. Scorpion energy with the moon. Queen of Wands is fire. Aries, Leo, Sag. Some of y'all are really getting mad. Mm, mm, mm. It's like you're saying to yourself, I could do this. I should do that. They don't know. They don't know me. You know, for what? That's what I don't understand. For what? Others of you are looking at the situation and you're like, you know what? Nix it. I'm going to just do me. I'm going to live my life and I'm going to live my life to the fullest. I like that. That's with the confidence of that queen of wands. But with this moon lingering, there's a dark side. I ain't going to lie. There's a dark side. Now, if you're put, uh, powering up and pushing forward, kudos to you. If you're powering up for revenge because you feel like you were wronged, I don't like it. Pineapples. Crowning energy with the lover and the five of wands. Oh, queen of swords and ace of cups. You are loving this queen of swords. God darn. Heavy emphasis on Libra, guys. Um... Mm, mm, mm. It's like you, you, I don't know, Gemini. This is almost, I don't know, unhealthy. I ain't gonna lie. It's almost unhealthy because it's like you see divine love and new and endless possibilities, and you see this. You see this as well as you could see yourself in the mirror when you're brushing your teeth. It's clear. It's very clear to you. And you struggle with that, like, because in your mind it's one way, but in reality it's another. Let me get one on the Ace of Cups. Let me have one on the Ace of Cups. I said one. Yeah, see, it's clear to you. But there's a tower with it. You're clearly committed. Hair font, again, Taurus energy. Um, you're clearly, it, it's like... You could see, you feel one way and you can't deny it, but you can also deny what you know to be reality. If they can, they conflict with one another. You understand what I'm saying? And the reality is, is that this is divine intervention. The tower is falling. Okay. The tower is falling and it's falling on everything that you feel that you know, but it's replacing it with divine truth. Not to say that what you feel that you know is wrong, but divine truth is the real truth. Okay? Uh, why is this energy undermining Gemini? Ten of Cups, please. Page of Wands. Please clarify. Undermining. We have a Four of Pentacles reverse. Refusing to let go. This is holding on. This is letting go. This letting go is undermining you. Let go of the dream. Let go of the deceit. Let go of the idea that this is the beginning. Let go of the fact that everyone you seem that you feel has betrayed you. Let it whatever the case is, let it go. Let it go. Because as long as you hold on to it, it hold you back from turning around to seeing the two full cups from embracing the confidence and uh passion and drive of the queen you understand because this confidence passion and drive is tied to this damn moon which has a dark side that's a mother lover okay so your future energy there's some trickery here i ain't gonna lie five of swords please clarify for gemini thank you and there you go lovers what you going to do? This is a decision that you're saying is driving you crazy. What are you going to do? Future energy. Clarify. 
Seven of Cups reverse. I like, and I like the Wheel of Fortune. Clarity coming through, understanding, truth, realization, forward movement. Thank you, Gemini. Let me get some more, please. Because you, I was scared. Ooh. And the star, Aquarian energy. Yes. Wish fulfillment, Aquarius. Can we leave it here? Ooh. Y'all had me nervous, and it's still hard. Ten of Wands. You saying green eyes, you just don't understand. And you're right. You're right. But we're here together. I'm going to help you as best I can, and I hope this helps. Okay? Um, if any event, none of this resonates for you guys, it's okay. Check out your moon and rising. But listen, don't take this energy with you, please. Leave it here for somebody else. Remember... We are all perfectly imperfect. And I apologize for some, sound like my neighbor just started mowing their lawn. So let me let you guys go. Bye.